hey guys welcome back to my channel as you guys can see we are doing a hair tutorial in this video and they are faux locks goddess locks and i did wrap them all individually um i am actually going to show you guys how i did it first without talking and then the second time i show you i will walk you through the process so keep watching to see how I got these locks. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how I did each lock or explain it. <laughs> and here I'm just showing you the locks that I've done already. And at the bottom, as you can see, the locks do get tangled because of all of the hair that's being left out. Um, but later in the video, I will show you how to deter the hair from getting tangled. So, as you can see, I did twist all of my natural hair up already individually. I didn't count all of my twists, um, but I will count all of my locks and put how many I have in the description box. So, the first thing I'm going to do is use some of the wefted hair that I cut. This is just a human hair bundle I had laying around the house. And here is a fourth of a piece of barley hair. I just cut it in half and then cut it in half again. And here is the free tress hair that I'm using for length. I'm gonna put all three of those together and braid it onto my hair. My twist is gonna act as the third strand uh, for the braid. I don't braid it all the way down you can if you would like um, but I just sprayed like three quarters of the way now I'm taking a long piece of Marley hair and just fluffing it out and then I'll be taking a little piece to kind of anchor just like a it's a really small section of the Marley hair you guys <laughs> and I'm just gonna lay that against my braid that I created and start wrapping around now with this step, you do want to be really careful because the more you twist, the tighter it's going to get. Uh, so as I twisted, I kind of like twisted it back so that it wouldn't be so tight on my hair. Around my edges, this was a little harder just because it really wants to twist the way you're twisting. So you just want to be really careful near your edges so that it doesn't hurt and you don't pull your hair out. <laughs> So once I twist a little the, a little of the way down, I'm going to go ahead and pull out some of the bundle hair that I incorporated, the shortest uh, curly hair that you have in the lock, and just kind of pull that out and pull it out of the way. Um, if you would like, you can use a clip to clip it out of the way, but I didn't feel like 
doing all that I just feel like I could just leave it out of the way for a little bit and then twist far enough down so that it's not in my way anymore so I just kind of move it out of the way and keep on twisting and this way the hair looks like it's naturally coming out of the lock so that's why I like to do it this way instead of like crocheting in extra pieces of hair um, but you're gonna go ahead and wrap all the way down the lock and secure it with a lighter okay so at this point it's lit because I'm almost done <laughs> I have like 10 more left at the top and I'm gonna show you guys how I do it two more times so I'm just taking that Marley hair again with the bundle hair and I'll be bringing it into the lock this time I did not use the free truss hair I just um, wrap the lock all the way down with Marley hair um, and I'll show you guys how like I split it up so I'm just showing you like a few different ways that I wrap some of the locks so that they're not all uniform As you can see towards the front I am taking out a lot of um, in each of the locks I have took out a smaller piece of the bundle hair uh, the curly hair and that's just because it's towards the front and I wanted a little more style in the front of course in the back I did not take out shorter pieces like this um, so I'm just doing that in the front but the back is pretty much just wrapped closer to the bottom and then at the bottom I'll have like a couple pieces hanging out and here I just split the Marley hair into two and it was a little tricky just because Marley hair is a little more put together than Kaneka Um, but I just split one piece off and continued wrapping with the remainder of the hair just to add that length. So this is how some of the locks are looking towards the front with uh, some of the hair left out of each and I'm literally almost done I have one more to go and I'm showing you guys how I do it again and this time I won't talk I will let you guys just watch and if you need a walkthrough again just rewind and rewatch the previous two times I did it
are finally done oh my god you guys it took me <laughs> it took me three days to finally finish doing all of this i twisted my natural hair up individually one day and then the next day i started twisting and the final third day i finished twisting um if i were to sit and do this all in one day which i don't think i could really do because i need a break It'd probably take me like 15 hours um but i'm glad that i broke it up um, so here i'm just showing you guys how to deter the tangling at the bottom i'm just using the cantu leave-in conditioner you can use like curl enhancing whatever just something moisturizing for the hair at the bottom and just run your fingers through it and don't worry about the white residue it'll go away <laughs> um, but i noticed after a few days um putting this on a couple times you know you only have to do it like twice and then the tangling is greatly reduced and here i'm just spraying this on my scalp when i first did these you guys they hurt so bad <laughs> my head was a little sore um so spraying on that carol's daughter leave-in conditioner spray really helped my scalp and in here i'm just putting on some oil to my scalp you guys can put any growth oil you want i just had this laying around the house so i was using that but that is about it for this style. I really hope that this tutorial helped all of you guys on your goddess block journey. <laughs> um, I know that I really like how mine turned out. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like the style. I've been getting a lot of compliments on the style. It's crazy. Like People will stop me and like, oh my god, I love your hair. Who did it? I did oh do you charge no because <laughs> as long as it took me to for me to do it on somebody else it takes too long um but go ahead and give this video a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i will see you guys in the next video bye